Hi, I'm Debbie and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're doing our Wednesday, Thursday readings, August 21st and 22nd for Virgo. Hello, my Virgos. It's almost time to say happy birthday to you. So happy birthday. Now, Wednesday and Thursday, I use my Radley Valentine Archangel Power Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy. But remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like, leave the rest. So I'm trying to, well, maybe not today, but I am trying to get my readings a little bit earlier because I've had people from other parts of the world say we need to see them a little earlier. Um, but I did get my September reading out, so I got that out on Sunday. And I also, because of technical issues, which I think Virgos would appreciate it, I um, basically, I took that and made it a separate video. But it does have a lot of energy. Um, it does, there's a lot of stuff happening. Maybe it doesn't have the same type of energy as July did, but it's still, I, I think it's worthwhile to watch. So um, I do want to apologize that I haven't gotten to my comments. The last couple of weeks have been like basically very hectic energy for me. I've been all over the place. And my main concern was to get the videos out for you. So let's go ahead and cut and see what Wednesday, Thursday is going to be like for my Virgos. And you're going, and I really, I, you know, you're, you're, if I remember correctly, you know that when I have my readings and once the message is delivered, it gets a little bit foggy for me, but you're, you're heading into a really good cycle, a good season. Okay, three cards, nothing is reversed, straight out message and change your life. Oh my gosh. Well, I guess you really don't need to have it reversed in order to get an Archangel Power Tarot card that talks about life-changing events. And so I, I really don't know how, I mean, you're going into a really great cycle and things could start happening for you. So now is that gonna be your job? Sure, it could be, because it's a relationship. You know, so it could be, you know, your job, career. And I do think I talked about possible career, like, like changes, like, so this is really, this is probably where the seeds are being put in place for these changes. Now. Could you Wednesday, Thursday, all of a sudden win the lottery and your life has changed? Oh yes, and remember me. But um, you know, but probably this is when maybe you look and you say, oh, you know what? I'm looking on the internet or I'm looking at my, you know, where I work and there's a job that I'm interested. I think I'll just put out the, uh, you know, put out my resume, okay? Or maybe it's something like there's somebody over there that I see, uh, you know, see every so often. I, I'm gonna say hello. It's like the something small, so it could be something small that creates something bigger, okay? So this is Archangel Shamuel, a sudden revelation that offers freedom. Break free of procrastination, embrace the opportunities that change brings. Now the one thing that I'll say about my Virgos is you want your change controlled. <laughs> so you, you, know, you want to know what your change is all about. It, so be aware that maybe Wednesday, Thursday, may be one of those days that just feels like out of control for you. Um, learn, you know, work, work with it, work with it, okay? But it does, you know, because when you work with it, and when it says embrace the opportunities that change bring, if, if things are a little out of control for you, you know, do your breathing, do your meditating, do whatever it is, commit, connect with that higher power, um, you know, just, work with it because by work, by not resisting it so much, I mean, if it's something that's totally wrong, I'm not telling you to work with it, but if it's something that, okay, this is not, I can't, I have no control over this, work with it because, you know, the opportunities will come up. So what could that mean? Again, I'll go with work. Um, work, you know, basically a project is dropped on your lap or project is dropped on your, you know, that you are part of a group now in this project. And it's like, whoa, how are we going to get this done? Breathe and work with it. Okay, next card. The page of Michael. Michael in this deck is about, um, is our air energy. It is our Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius energy. You know, it's our thoughts. It's our Wi-Fi. It's those things sometimes that we just pick up. And pages, pages to me are very, you know, they're, they're impulsive. They're the ones that can like, yeah, we can get anything done. So this is kind of that good thought. So here, if you're having, if you're having this, whatever this change is, you know, that might be showing you some opportunities, 
I feel that you, if you can keep yourself to a point, if you can, like I said, breathe and get through this, it's like, I think that you're going to see those opportunities. Now, maybe you won't necessarily recognize them for what they are just yet, but you know, you're going to then kind of say, you know what though, I think I'm, I'm going to support this, or I may not support this, but it's like you, you just kind of make, again, it's those little things, those little change. I don't know if, I don't want to say changes. It's those little um, efforts or that little push in that direction that does make bigger changes. So Paige and Michael is truthful, perceptive, analytical, blunt. An exciting new challenge. You have what it takes to succeed. Review contracts or documents very thoroughly. So here we have two cards talking about something is coming that's new. Okay, next card. The Emperor. Okay, the Emperor is all about organization. It's all about ruling. But it's also, this is another Archangel energy card. Okay, so this is a very strong energy card for you. Archangel Uriel, stability and efficiency, taking charge of a situation, ambitious plan. So, you know, to me, it's again, it's like, you know, again, it's it's organization. It's and maybe that's what's going to be happening. Maybe you're going to put be put into a position where you need to organize it. And, you know, they can't ask for a better person than a Virgo to organize it. So, you know, so it's really this Wednesday and Thursday energy could be in itself very strong for you or it could be starting because you're going into your Virgo season a very strong season for you okay but it's like it's it's one of opportunity it's one of I do feel it's one of optimism I do feel it again I you know it's optimistic change optimistic opportunity but I do feel it's an extremely optimistic um, energy starting this Wednesday Thursday for you okay so I like that for you my Virgos my Virgos, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.